Welcome to Ultimate Clout Gamer, hosted by Keith Clout. We're getting into the thick of it today, and when I say thick of it, there's a lot of stuff to do. A lot of stuff to do. Damn it. Fucking slow frames. Yep, yeah, but we finally got transportation to travel around the desert. Hell, let's go to the fastest spot. Closest spot. Man, this is so dope. This is... This is definitely better than the original game. Riding around in this dune buggy. According to legends passed down in Corel, whenever humanity strays from the proper course, Alexander appears to render his righteous judgment. His pronouncements are absolute and cannot be defied. Parents sometimes tell misbehaving children that Alexander might come and smite them if they refuse to shape up. Yep. The original game, that thing was far from a monster. It looks like a Hot Wheel. Kayak will tell you when it. You know, because he, he played the original game just like I did. One of our favorite games growing up. The original Final Fantasy VII. You have that punch buggy, that buggy is a monster. That's what she said. That was incredible. It was as if you and the crystal were actually communicating with one another. Oh, I 
didn't even know. Oh, I didn't even see that question. Because that's the way it, it goes, man. Like, it gives people enough time so they can um, join in. But, uh, like, I gotta work on, you know, trying to come in a little bit early. Like, tomorrow I'm gonna try to come in earlier, if possible. The, the whole countdown thing's about, you know, getting, like, making sure, like, there's enough people in here. Get, like, gathering people, giving them time. Time to waste indeed. Especially now that we have this car to get around, it makes everything faster. Uh, um, I think it's going to still be usable, but I just, in the desert, just like in the original game, you use that instead. I think it's going to come back in the, in the next area, I believe. short for a while like probably until two Sundays from now
but we got like returning to doing Uber this like Saturday. Yep, I'm definitely like next Friday, next uh, Thursday and Friday I'll be doing Uber again. And um, next Saturday I have some. I'm gonna stream for a little bit, but I got some business to attend to that is going to help with promotion of. Of my tra of my trademark, like just a whole business. Like I, I need to work on that some. Because like I have somebody down here uh, that's down to do some um, marketing promotion stuff with me. Because I definitely need to get these clips out. I need, I need to, you know, get in more people, for sure. For sure. <laughs> Why would I wait to have a bigger audience? That's, that's wild. The goal is to have a bigger audience at the, at the rip. Because I'm trying to get paid uh, from um, Twitch, like eventually. I mean, it, it, it's not guaranteed. It's still probably gonna take a process, but nah. Let's use some uh, items, definitely. Jeez, man. What the hell? is how the better question is how to get up there what is going on here this is the first tower I've had dealt with where I have no idea how to get up to I, I thought I like I would need to shoot up a hook but how wow oh okay is it right up there? Oh, okay. Yep, it is right up here.
game of that one mini game also you can call the buggy that shit is cool oh shit yeah I haven't used that yet that is really cool get down there. I mean, perhaps, maybe. Keep it together. Here just increased. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, yeah. I mean, he was going to be. I mean, he in the original game, he's part of it. It's just he's usually not in the original game, he wasn't separated from the mod, that giant stuffed thing, the giant stuffed toy. Man, I forgot. I, I need to uh, definitely... put up some of this material on people. Why is that not equipped? It needs to be equipped. before we get to the, its final level.
nice. Good. What the hell? What's he doing with empowerment? He shouldn't have empowerment. He should have magnify. That's actually gonna be more useful. That magnify needs to be leveled up heavy. I see, I see, all right. They're not linked, so I guess that means we gotta put some other, something else. Okay, maybe we can leave that. Yep, there we go. For now. Terry learns his ability, and then we're gonna throw like kick him off the team. Start learning other people's abilities. was kind of wild. Actually, I think while well, trying to do streaming the other shit, I wanted to see how it's going to go down in the future. I think if I could potentially turn down the settings, that might help. Does that just seems like something that would be better. chaotic is that oh shit not again what the hell it froze again what's going on what the fuck Sorry about that, y'all. Jeez. Like, I don't know what the slow frame stuff's about. Like, it's terrible.
Nice, <laughs> that was dope. Yo, is everything good on your side? Uh, okay, might as well create that. get down there is the real question that beckons question that's the question that beckons wait a second yeah, we're fleeing that's right Yep. Oh, he's got two different guns. Man, we're with Barrett for a while. Be Barrett for a while. And Yuffie. Hey, bro, you still on? the slow frames are about today like it, it like it was acting up last night too hopefully it knocks it off Oh, 
okay, you're good. You're good. I was just making sure everything was working fine over there. Yep, you're good. How the hell do I get down here? There might be only one way to really get down there. I think I see it right here. I hope that's what I'm seeing. Oh, I didn't know. Okay, I figured it out myself. Like, that wasn't the point where I was gonna go, but... Hey, that works. But what's back here? The real question. You know what? We're gonna go to the f go this way first. Huh, another life spring. Ooh. 
What's up, bro? Yeah! That's the way it ended all last night. You know, Chief, I asked Cloud, could you drive? What's up, brother? How are you? Damn, that sucks, bro. Well, hopefully you get better soon. better than the old game like the way you're just look like driving around in this thing like in the old like I was telling Saucy you know in the old game it looks like you were driving around a hot wheel in the, in the desert in a large sandbox Indeed, uh huh. Machines even, yep. It kind of looks like this buggy kind of looks like you know um, when you're driving around on a Jeep, you're using like Google Maps and you see your car on the map. Yeah, that icon, like it looks like a shittier version of that. in this area I'm trying to remember what those things are called but <laughs> exactly oh that's crazy Oh! <laughs> 
Yup, exactly. <laughs> yup, hell yeah, bro. Tiny Brocco. Took so long. The there was the delay about. He just stared at me creepily. Everything you helped me learn about Alexander. Thank you. Ah, though you have yet to obtain the requisite materia, as I recall, you'll first need to confront the divine via the combat simulator. I don't know. Oh wait, is the stream lagging on your side? I mean, if it is, I'm so, that sucks, man. I'm sorry. Like, I got like two slow frames. Oh, okay. No, like, yeah. I mean, he's a robot after all. I, I guess that makes sense. How the hell did this thing come up here? I, I okay. <laughs> I didn't call for it. Yeah, I see. Uh -huh. It's so cool, man. Like, you can, like, call the buggy to you. It's dope as hell. Like, 
<laughs> Man, like, Ace set definitely handles a little odd, but like, it's not bad. It's just, I, I can't prefer, see myself preferring to play as him. I knew it. What the hell? How do you get in here? This, this, wow. I don't even know what this is. So... I mean, maybe... Yeah, um... I, I know, I know it's like it's the Cactar. Cactuar, I guess. Cactuar. We, I don't know what we're supposed to do with that exactly. That's very curious what that's about. Somebody tells me that's one of the... I guess, something hidden. Yep, the Cactuar. Maybe you need to summon. Maybe. What the hell? Speaking of the. Um, speaking of the cat bar. You could be right. Uh. Oh, nice. Okay, she's learned her time to switch her out. Time to switch out. Barrett needs to learn uh, one more ability before I can set, set him back to the bat. Yeah, I'll check those pipes though, definitely. The original team. Nice, Star Shower. Yep. <sighs> the thing is pretty nice though.
we need get, we need to really upda- upgrade this magnify. Very, very useful. I've been waiting a long time to get my hands on one of these. We need to really level this shit up. Light your to rescue. Yep, exactly. That's why I keep going on about magnify. It's ba- it's the all materia. Like when you play far enough into the first game, you get magnify. It isn't really far in the game at all. Like they actually made you wait for magnify this time. But yep. You know, you know how valuable all materia is. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, and I was wondering when it was going to show up. And unfortunately, Kate Sith has held on to it this whole time. Or Kite Sith, since he's Irish, I guess. I don't know how you pronounce it. to the Temple of Ancients, if I recall right. Ain't no thing! Hurry up! Yeah. 
Exactly. Gonna be like that for about, you know, almost like a week and a half. get over there. That thing. Okay. That tower is up there. So this tells me that there's a way to climb up. There has to be. be nice. That'd be nice to fly. It would also, you know, be kind of weird. At least in this game, it'd stray away from some of the original game. Uh -huh. Damn, a lot of Moogle medals. way to get in there because I see a ladder maybe you can get in there oh I think I see something no Oh 
man. Where is... Okay, so you can't get up there. I was wrong, but I know there has to be a treasure somewhere around here. Damn, I thought you could jump up there. Oh, wait. No? Damn. earlier I'm having issues right now trying to find this treasure chest jeez oh there we go Swallow saw embracer. What's that? Oh, okay. So it's a new piece of actual armor. That's dope. Making sure. Because I know my stream stopped for a moment. I was like, what's going on? Like it, like it froze for a moment. Yep. Dude, it is armor. Oh, okay. It's different things for different people. I see now. I still don't have any idea how to get to that thing right here. But I have a feeling I know. Like, I think I have to come this way. So we need to go this this way first. Pretty sure he, he is. That's the only way you can view this is live. Oh, damn. Oh, 
But I didn't know I could fall down there like that. help that you have a bunch of people on the internet. just to up the internet with that many people, but what you gotta do? Uh -huh. I still can't upgrade nothing. Yep, I feel it, brother. Yep, for sure, bro. <laughs> What are you like, what the hell about? Oh, yeah. Nice. Yep. Well, if I knew more about the game, I'd probably be more impressed. <laughs> Finally, one of the. I got a rare Pete. 
Mithra orb, huh? Ah, they keep track of all these things. That's dope. Okay, the materials. Oh, okay, that. Guess that isn't completely rare, but it is. Because, yeah, it is. I remember now. It is pretty rare. So I've seen it at the gold saucer for 100 points. complete. Let's go this way. What's up, Al? Well, He doesn't need to. I think it's Aerith that needs to tra train another th thing. Yep.
Yeah, I'm just looking up a guide, a, a build guide. Actually, I have a good idea now what I should constantly be putting on these characters.
Another one done. Son. Cloud! Upon analyzing the data from the life spring, I was able to locate a new transmuter chip. The chip can be found in a village abandoned due to desertification. This erosion will spread if left unchecked. And eventually, the entire village will be swallowed by the sands. Do try to collect the chip before that happens. It makes items appear, I guess. Like, it makes new things and... Uh, like, it makes new things appear and... Like, and items or locations. And it gathers like myth uh, like mithra ore for you, and myth mithra ore seems to be rare. Yeah, exactly. But it was more uh, easy to understand compared to Final Fantasy VIII's junction system. This is some interesting stuff to read. Yep. You know, um, it like it is if you want to like get the jump on the enemies. I mean. If you notice, I'm doing a lot better on the enemies now that I've been tinkering around with, you know, mate the material more. Keep it together. Taking the front seat. Yep, yeah, but I mean, shoot, like Final Fantasy Eight is just a crazy in general. But like the fact that you don't, you can't like the only way to really beat Final Fantasy Eight, besides understanding the junction system, is to not level up. You're not supposed to level up. Yeah, I mean, yes and no, I don't know, possibly, Final Fantasy V, which I played after, sometime after, you know, oh wait, that's right, that was just Jaws, never mind, it, 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 this would probably be the first game, it was the first game that you can tinker with the abilities. Yep. Oh, I was already here. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yep. You gotta keep Mr. Bitches motivated. Don't overdo it. I'm coming. Get him. I got you. 
She's gotta keep Mr. Bitches motivated. Ugh. Yep. are definitely strong in this game, for sure. I'll be right back. I think, you know, uh, like, I think 12 definitely has the potential to be one of the best. Uh, I, I have yet to beat that one. And maybe I should consider it, like, streaming that one day so I can actually beat it for once. Got, I'm gonna get more coffee. I also gotta make sure that I'm okay going into work. <laughs> really? You've beaten two and three? That's wild. I haven't even beaten two or three. But I've beaten one, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, and fifteen, and sixteen.
And I'm back, y'all. Uh. one of these spots let's seal two at the picking up this damn thing I'm not gonna sit on my little cushion. I can't believe they got rid of a tent just for a cushion. Well, my butt's not sore no more. I guess that gives me full HP and MP. any pipes are connected to getting in there. I think I'm gonna have to come back with the Cactuar summon. Cactuar. Exactly. 
Okay, you gotta climb up a cliff to get to this one. It's up this one. Yes and no. It would be nice if they actually gave you something rare. I think though, you, they, they, you could steal something rare off them. I think in the old game. things that are around and only cactuar 630 got under an hour right now I think I might have spent some money on that FF mobile game, Final Fantasy mobile game. I'm, I'm not 100%, but yeah, it's happened. Oh, okay, yep. Got you. Got 
gotcha, bitch. Here I come. Indeed, no surprises there. That's why, yep, that's how they get you. Maybe this this game though is worth the money. I definitely, definitely, wholeheartedly. This must be the sandstorm. Enjoy, have enjoyed this game every bit of the way. What the fuck? What the hell is this? What's going on? What in the world? was I to the Morgus presence? And lo, whither should it lead me but these sweltering sands? What is this thing? No way. What wow. is fortune for you to venture so far for treasure already Yeah, I remember that guy. You That's wild. To leave, that I may collect what is by rights mine. You think the proto relic is yours? Proto what now? Relic, you say? Ha! Ah, a ridiculous name, unworthy of my treasure. This is ridiculous. What, what the hell? None other than a prize in my resplendent arsenal. The get. Uh -oh. Oh. Yeah, this was not in the original game. I can hold no longer. What the hell? It's falling apart now. Oh, what was that? Exactly. Oh, thank goodness I finally got through. Are you all right? I'm fine. But what the hell was that just now? Exactly. I'm investigating the matter as we speak. In my initial analysis of the sand entity, I detected a proto-relic-like signal. I'm unsure how they're connected, but I fear we might be after the same thing. Of course we are. There's no telling where it might appear next. It probably Please would have been a really difficult enemy. But it's definitely related to that this item, that this whatever this is. Like that spot right there.
Yep. Fuck. Fuck everything that's, a, you know, a card game, unless it was actually meant to be a card game. Like, the only card games I like is M Magic and Yu-Gi-Oh. That's it. <laughs> Yeah, me too, bro. Hold up, I'm gonna get some water. I, I feel hot now. Nope, I'm here. No, I need to use a bathroom. Not yet, anyways. Wow. <laughs> wow. I think you might have told me that story, Chaotic, but that's pretty wild. Yeah, I'm sure they are. Okay, now I can mess around with this. Oh! It's some sort of monster's den. A fortress, if you will. Whatever it is, I don't think we can get inside. Ugh. Whoa. Do you know what person? What's up? I have a match. Is there somebody the else? An ancient tome. Allow me to translate. <laughs> I didn't even go to the bathroom. I went in to get to water. You want to locate a cactuar rock hidden somewhere in the desert. What kind of rock? A mineral deposit named for its distinct cactuar shape. Cactuar. I never knew it was called cactuar. The seek should be marked by a green glow. By the way. Do you happen to see a cactuar shaped statue anywhere nearby? Uh. Oh! That's it! That statue should guide you to the rock I spoke of, which in turn will serve as the key to the door. So we must prove ourselves worthy. I know you can do it. Oh, that's wild. That's dope. Oh, shit. Okay. That's pretty dope.
So it's over in this direction. Oh, you can do it in the... Nice. You can do it in your car. Okay. Shortly in the car. Those areas were about. Yeah. I mean, you're not lying. Shit, back then we definitely didn't have no monies. Yeah, he was he wasn't in our group, that's for sure. So it's right there. Okay, so how do you get in there? Do you ram it? Okay, I guess we're gonna have to try to ram it. Hmm, or maybe it's on the other side. Found something else, though. Nope. You definitely don't know him personally. I don't know him personally. Man, I don't think I met him once. I've only heard about him. Yeah. Yep, I feel it. What the hell? How do you... Damn it, how do you get to this damn thing? Okay, so it's in here, but where in here? What the hell? So what, do you gotta go up here? Apparently you do, and there's apparently probably a cave up in there. Okay. So we gotta get up there. Okay, I see now. Ah, it's... Okay. I know where we have to go, possibly.
gotta make our way down here. Down there, what? What do you want, you damn cacti? You wanna die, don't you? So it's my turn? You can do it! I don't think so. Now, with that said, I've already, I've dropped like half, almost half that on all the equipment and, and upgrading my internet, so I guess there's that. I don't think so. You guys are crazy. I got, like, debts and stuff to take care of. I'm trying not to spend nothing at all this year, like, game-wise, if I can have it. I already, like, you know, spent, like, a, a small little bit only because this shit was cheap and it's, you know, games I'm gonna actually stream. The only game I'm getting next is Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Because I, I, I planned on it since it first got announced months and months ago. Just like that, okay? Yeah, I'm sure, but, you know, I know how to say no. I say no to the PlayStation and Nintendo Switch sales. said responsibilities the only way I'd ever spend you know money on games like that is if I was in a position where I no longer had to work for BMW and I'm just paid well for the rest of my life I'm coming you've got this I got it I mean, thanks to Gamefly, I don't need to. That's one thing I'm enjoying about Gamefly. <laughs> no, I, I need, I need it, bro. Like, I need to be responsible, bro. Like, after what, like last year. And especially with the fact that now my PlayStation 5, like, it, it's been like this for months, but I finally paid it off. I don't think that would be enough to beat out BMW, though. Like, three grand's okay, but I, I, I'm easily gonna be making more than that here soon. Like, in about two years, I'm gonna be making more than that. <laughs> Go. Yeah, because you're renting, but it doesn't mean I want to buy every game. Like the point of Gamefly is so you don't waste your money on games you don't want to buy. Like, Prince of Persia looks good, but I don't want to buy it. Like, I had a little fun with it, but I didn't want to buy it. Like, whatever popular game that's coming out next, you know, I'm going to, you know, like, play, obviously. No, like, I mean, that's not... I like 
buying certain games, not every game I can find. <laughs> I, I don't know, I just don't think I could. Like that, that's crazy that that guy that spent 3000 did on a mobile game, but it's like, that's insane to me still. You know, I've never paid that much money in gaming and games. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Why is it? <laughs> Why is it when you said you lie, it reminded me like I just thought of a movie. I'm just, I can't think of what movie it was, but I thought about it. Nope. Like I have Gamefly to save me all money. That's but at the end of the day, that's what it is. So I don't waste my money on games I don't want. <laughs> Listen, I'd spend money on games. I would. I just don't. I couldn't see it being all at once, though. Three thousand. Maybe over time. Oh shit! Oh shit! I doubt I'm gonna ever get that much. Like, bro, like, y'all, I don't think you realize how many games I have just between the PS5, the Switch, and the PS3. Yeah. Like, I have a lot it, just it, between those th three systems in general. The reason why I didn't say the PS4 is the PS5 can play almost all of the PS4 games. So it's like a PS5 and a PS... It's both a PS5 and a PS4, the PS5 is. If you didn't know. I, I feel that... I, I, I feel it chaotic, but I'm not gonna buy every game that I play. That's not worth it to me. So, like, there's games that in the past that I feel that I wasted money on, that I don't, on games that I shouldn't have spent my money on. Like, there, there definitely have been there, and I don't, that's why I'm down with Gamefly nowadays. Smart people that don't want to waste their money on games they don't want. That's who rents games. Now, I'd be throwing my money away if I spent it on a game I didn't want. I don't want Prince of Persia. Like, yeah, it looks enjoyable, but it doesn't mean I want it. <laughs> that's wild. That That's crazy. That's pretty good. That's pretty good on Steam. Now, what I need to do here is set my materia up. The 
for facing this guy. I feel it. I mean, I've double dipped too before. I mean, actually, I've quadruple dipped at this point. I've quadruple, nearly quad. Yeah, the Borderlands series. I think at this point, I've either triple dipped or quadruple dipped at this point. I definitely have my weight in games. That's why I'm not really in a rush to get any stream games. And I, I prefer still playing on a console. Nobody's going to convince me that playing a, on a PC is better. No one will or ever will. There's people out there like that. My homie down here, one of my best friends down here, he's not with PC game, like gaming at all. And it doesn't matter how much better all the little fancy gadgets all the fancy graphics you could do on the pc it doesn't it won't convince them <laughs> yeah skyrim i triple dipped on unfortunately <laughs> ps3 ps4 and switch <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I've got to say, nobody wants to play on a keyboard and mouse. I think that's what it, a lot of the, what it comes down to for these, you know, console-only gamers. Yeah, but just imagine a world where you didn't. It probably wouldn't be nearly as popular if it if it if it didn't have that ability. <laughs> Bruh, this has nothing to do with mind control. It has to do with nostalgia. The, the feeling of having a control in your hand. And nothing beats it. Nothing beats that old feeling. It has nothing to do with whatever everybody else is doing. <laughs> if that was a fact, I would have jumped on the Xbox train back in the 2010s. Like, you know, I didn't jump on Xbox 360 like that. Like, I, yeah, I had one for a moment, but I, like, at the end of its life cycle, I had an Xbox 360. <laughs> yep. I, I, I'm okay with that. Like, I, I don't mind, you know, playing with the controller. Like, my um, hand-eye coordination really isn't as good as it used to be, neither. Like, it, I think it, it's went down, a, like, you know, and because of age, I guess. It, it doesn't matter, to, like, it, it doesn't matter about the controller. You're right, you can't, because why bother having an Xbox when I can just get Game Pass? Like, that's probably, like, the, one of the few, you know, things I'm going to like about having th this Windows computer now is... Now I, I definitely don't have to buy an Xbox ever. Mm -hmm. It could just, you know, stay last place compared to the systems in the PC where it belongs. Bro, because nobody, like, I just, bro, it's just, it's just tied to having a controller and what I grew up with. It, it, like, it has little to do with, um, what's better. I, I think that's what it comes down to, nostalgia, which isn't a strong, you know, good reason, but nostalgic is one hell, nostalgia is one hell of a drug, so they say.
Okay, man, but um, I'd be very angry if I had a PC, but I couldn't play Final, you know, Final. Let's say Sony didn't give up the rights to play this game, because eventually you can play this on PC. I'd be angry if I couldn't play this game. I can't play the next Mario Odyssey on the PC. I can't play the next Zelda. Like, that's good enough reasons where I'm like, you know what? PC I, is cool, but I'm glad I have both now. I have both. <laughs> so I, I like, you know, I get to have all the exclusives and a PC. So that, you know, at least I'm uh, like, at least I'm good there. <laughs> Not from other people, man. Really, my I'm not a follower at all. I just like what I like. If I really, when it comes to gaming, I like what I like. It doesn't matter how much better the PC is. I know you have more freedom. I know about that shit. I know about, uh, what's it called? Um, you know, like, you can, like, change up the games. And I, I, I like some of the fan games. Like, there's this, uh, game called, uh, what's it? Metroid, like, another Samus remake, which is basically a remake of, uh, Metroid 2 for the Game Boy. That game is dope. Like, I, like it's actually banned from Nintendo. Like, I don't know why, other than the fact that it's a fan-made game that was probably better. I don't really have much hours of PC gaming. I don't, but I mean, I'm not gonna just play that over my, the PS5, especially in, with the game I have right now in my hands. Why would I choose Borderlands 1 over this game? A game that I've beaten a, a bit of times. <laughs> huh? No, I actually have Steam downloaded. That's how, you know when we played Sonic? That was, I bought that off Steam. Mm hmm. And we're very identified. Damn, well, I gotta say, I'm not, you know, too surprised. That, that's crazy, though. Their digestion is also Nice, yeah, like, like I said, that was nice, like, it's funny too, though, because, you know, like we said, like, Voldemort, he would be, he, he, he would have said, like, you know, it's about time you did. I didn't know you had that many hours in the vision, though. That's so. That was a good game. I, I wish they didn't, you know, stop with, you know, like, with, like they had something that was actually dope. Like, I mean, a dope, you know, expansion, some dope DLC. You know, 
Like you said, I haven't spent much time PC gaming. Uh-huh. Yeah, I, I bet, man. Makes more sense with a mouse and a keyboard is Diablo. Like Diablo is definitely one of the games that makes more sense. League of Legends is also another one that makes more sense with a mouse and keyboard. <laughs> yeah, I, I bet though. Like Stardew Valley will, will be better on that PC with the mods. Hmm. I don't know about all that, bro, but I mean, it probably is pretty good, but I don't know, like, when running it on set like the the five is great like it looks fantastic there there's probably barely a difference with the uh, seven and eight compared to the PC with the five because there those are like PS5 like like they have PS5 versions of but like I played both of them and they're like both crispy as hell. Uh, I don't know, like, there's something about Resident Evil games that feel better with a controller. I've never played it on a, like, you know, PC. No, wait. Actually, I take that back. I've played Resident Evil 4 on PC. I don't know, man. I, I, don't, I just don't see that. Like, you know, there's certain games I can play better with a controller in my hand and certain games I can play with better with a mouse and keyboard in my hand. Resident Evil is not one of them. Resident Evil isn't one that I'm ever going to consider doing a keyboard and mouse with. Hell no. <laughs> Definitely too r difficult for me. Nope. Uh -huh. Should I ever play Queen's Blood? <laughs> no. <laughs> but I imagine I'd die probably within the first five minutes. <laughs> like, I mean, I'm talking about the old Resident Evil games, though. But, I mean, the new Fair ones, I, I don't know. But the old ones, you really need a controller for. I'm coming. Well, I'm not spending that money on RE7 and RE8 again. Nope. I'm cool. I don't even care if it's on a sale now. I 
Oh, nice. It's so that's the way it's gonna be. The gold saucer. Damn. PC with streaming and PC at the same time. I don't, I don't know how I'm going to really play it. Well, I could play without streaming, I guess, but that isn't the goal anymore. I think, though, upgrading this PC is what I need to do. We need to get more RAM. I think more RAM is going to make a difference. I think we'll be able to play Borderlands, bro, alright? This computer is not shitty. You know what's shitty? The internet I'm using. They're the, sh they're the shitty internet. Plus, like I said, the settings... The settings, um... I think I need to lower the settings in the, uh, if I were to try Borderlands. Like, I keep forgetting that I have to tinker with everything in order to get things to work better on the stream. Now, what I would like is a Steam Deck, though. I'd probably be more swayed to play PC games if it was a Steam Deck. Because to me, that's... That's fucking some next level shit to Steam Deck. Actually, in some ways, it might be better than the Switch. That I can admit of with regards to that. So the next time I play Borderlands, it's gonna be on PC. But I'm going. I'm, I I need to set up the. I gotta set up. Like I need to set up to work better the next time I try, because I was having issues with it, streaming, and doing this at the same time. In this game right now though so it's kind of hard for me to be interested in that when I have this game in front of me 
Eyes on you. I'm coming. You can do it. I got you. You're up. I'll show come you. Come on, how really? Ah, uh, come the fuck on, you stupid worm. You just fucked everything up, you stupid fucking worm. I can sense it already. And I even have his weakness. If only she would have come out. Stupid alarm. Your turn. All set. 
damn it, I almost had him that one time. Yeah, I mean, there isn't. Just, uh, the only problem in this world with that is some people, some people just really don't like it. Uh, really, really don't like it. Uh, Come on! <laughs> Gotta be careful. Yeah, but unfortunately, I wish I had a little more time. Like I already, I already had, you know, a good opportunity to kill him earlier when he was really low. I didn't know that. I didn't know he had Blizzara as well. The gold saucer has Three. led to a steady increase in the traffic. And as by magic, a corresponding increase in land work of the traffic. As we travelers, we must understand what makes this very entertaining. But... Just know I'm cheering for you! This is unfortunate. Rare land or variant identity. Yeah, I know. And I don't even find that cactuar uh, rock, but I have a feeling it's up there. But anyways. I have a good, like, I'm going to actually peace out, y'all. And... It's, it's that time I gotta get ready. Uh, I gotta go to work. Uh. So, yep. Uh, yep, see you on the next episode of The Ultimate Clout Gamer.